Happy birthday, Clemmy! Whoops! My hand is celebrating separately! Good morning! Oh no! I totally forgot! Today is our zombie friend Clementina's birthday! Oh, I mean, death day! We need to come up with a present for her! All girls love toy bunnies! And I have a zombie bunny for our zombie girl! Cut bunny parts from fabric. Sew them together with a thick thread using big stitches. Fill it with stuffing and sew the hole shut. Sew all the ready parts to make a bunny. Cut round eyes and a heart from black felt. Sew them to the bunny with big stitches. I'll give it to Clementina as soon as she wakes up. Zombie bunny, meet your zombie mama. Who's here? <gasps> Clementina, you scared me to death. Happy death day to you, my zombie friend. Oh, what an adorable zombie bunny. Is that for me? Thanks. Let's play a fun game for Clementina's death day. Cut a cardboard roll into identical pieces. Cover the sides with cardboard circles. Attach a printed picture of a zombie head to the roll. Make 10 pieces like this with different heads. I brought the heads of your zombie friends. Let's use them to build a pyramid. You have to break it with an ax. I see. The pyramid is ready. Clementina, where are you? What's going on in here? The zombie decided to take a real axe. Let the games begin. Clemmy, hang on. Control your instincts. You don't need a real axe. We have a safe, light axe. Aim for the head, but not your head, the zombie heads. Uh -huh. Cut an axe from cardboard. Make two pieces. Glue them together and wrap them in felt. No! She missed! Thank goodness the axe isn't real! Clemmy, stop aiming at my head! Yay! Clemmy, you won! Pizza delivery! But this isn't a regular pizza. It's radioactive. A zombie pizza just for Clementina. Coat a ready pizza crust with white sauce. Put on chopped mushrooms and chicken. Sprinkle it with grated cheese. Make a radiation sign with chopped dark olives. Bake in an oven for 10 minutes at 390 degrees. Put the pizza in a box with a radiation sign. Tin, get ready! We are about to eat my favorite pizza. Is it safe? Double cheese never killed nobody! Clementina, look! Oh, Tin! You finally became a zombie too! I'm kidding, it's just a prank! Tin, that's not funny! It seems like the birthday girl is upset! I need to make a surprise for her! Tin is throwing a surprise party for Clemmy. Everything is ready. Tin took care of all the smallest details. Even the cups are decorated for a zombie party. Squeeze red acrylic paint onto a plate with raised edges. Dissolve it with water. Put on a glove and dip your hand in it. Leave a red pattern on a white paper cup. Decorate a lot of cups like this. And now, let's call our friends! Yay! The party starts now! Bruce, pour the drinks! The cups for the bloody punch are over there! What an interesting pattern! Guys, have some punch! Bloody punch is this party's signature drink! There's someone's hand floating in it! Fill a rubber glove with blood orange juice. Tie it up and freeze it. Cut a grapefruit and two oranges into circles. Put the 
them in a big bowl. Add ice on top. Pour in blood orange juice and soda water. Put in the frozen hand. This punch is so tasty and refreshing. But there's something in here. Hang on. What's this? A finger? That's disgusting. Bruce, don't worry. It's just ice. Wow, you really can't take a joke, huh? <laughs> Quiet! Clementina is coming! Hide! And I'll bring the cake! Are these brains with candles? Cover a round bowl with plastic wrap. Place pieces of a sponge roll cake on the bottom and the sides. Coat with a layer of whipped cream. Put a layer of chopped bananas on top. Coat it with cream again. Keep on making layers of cream and sponge cake until the bowl is full. Put a layer of sponge rolls on top. Cover with plastic wrap and refrigerate for a few hours. Coat the hardened cake using pink colored whipped cream. Put the cream in a pastry bag and create a pattern of a brain on the surface of the cake. Make it look like a real brain. What a weird cake! And here's the birthday girl! Happy birthday! Ah! A zombie! Run! Clementina, I'm so sorry! But look at this beautiful cake! A pink brain! Just the way you like it! Oh, look! The apocalypse! Surprise! Happy death day, Clementina! Try my cake, Tin! What a great party! Zombies are coming for you! This is my worst nightmare! What's going on in here? Tin, I can't reach your tombstone! Can you help me? Sure, Clemmy! You need your grave? Why? Ah! I see! There's a speaker hidden in it! Cut a tombstone out of thick cardboard. Glue a cardboard arch on top. Use masking tape. Out a rectangular hole and glue on black felt. Cut out foam paper to fit the tombstone. Write RIP on it and cut it out with a utility knife. Glue the foam paper on top of the cardboard. Wrap the whole piece in foam paper. Glue two loops of elastic inside over the hole. Also wrap a rectangular box in foam paper. Attach the tombstone to the base. Put a loudspeaker in the loops. Tin, turn it up! What a musical tombstone! Let's do a zombie dance! I'll lure the sleeping zombie with the smell of sweet bones. Dampen marshmallows with water and join three pieces together. Cut two marshmallows at an angle and connect them. Snip off a corner and attach it to both sides of the long marshmallow piece. Shape a bone. Let's check out Clementina's reaction. Oh, wow, you were so aggressive. Run! Don't get between the zombie and her bones. Clementina will find them anyway! Parkour in the kitchen! Nice! I reached the target! My precious! I love soft bones! Yum yum! Did you like our zombie birthday? Then comment below how you'd celebrate! Would you make a zombie present, play a zombie game, or eat a zombie cake? And don't forget to give this video a thumbs up! Subscribe to our channel and click on the bell so you don't miss new zombie ideas from Troom Troom!